if we had more steady traffic, maybe we'd have more steady participation. Instead of more of a conversation with the people that right. are interested. So now you should show up on our, even without it, it shows them even if they don't have a picture. So go to what's, Salt Lake County. Right Just go to p down on and click, some, click on the map link. Maps link. So, oops, I'm not trying to select stuff. So you're down here in Sugar House somewhere. Mm -hmm. Which one do you think you do? I can zoom in. That here. huge pile of people right there. Right about here. <laughs> here, let's let's do this. Let's so this Google mashup was all done in PHP. Yeah, yeah. This is just something I put together. I'm I'm. Uh, let's see, seventy. I'm twenty-first. That one's That's probably you. Right yeah. Right. So now, if you had sent a picture in here, let's. I'm just going to refresh this page. If you'd send a picture and it will show up highlighted, you see. Mm -hmm. The ones that are highlighted, you can click to see the picture. Okay, so here's, here's the $24 million question. Uh -huh. What does this do for the campaign? Well, it does a couple of things. First, um, it provides a very unscientific gauge of how we're doing in an area. <laughs> Other reasons it's good for the campaign is upload your picture, you know, put your kid or dog or pet. This has only been on since yesterday, so we're still getting oh. more. Oh, that's why I didn't. Yeah. Cool. We've had this data for a while, but the ability to, uh, to, to put it on a map and upload it to space just yesterday. So it, it, it so. engenders um, interaction. Yeah.